review slash recap for episode 52 of Dragon Ball Super. I believe it's titled Reunion of... It's like Reunion Master and Student and the subtitle is like Trunks and Gohan. Alright, so that pretty much gives away what pretty much went down in this episode. Um, basically, it showed Belma and Pilaf. Well, it is basically Belma and the dog dude and mind us helping her early at the beginning of the episode, like getting the equipment and stuff to fix up the machine. And on um, Kid Trunks, he was basically trying to get my attention because he's he's feeling he's feeling our uh, own um, competition with his older self, you know. Because my she's like when, when Trunks walks into the room, saying my just drops everything he does and try to look all cute and stuff for it. Future Trunks, you know. But um, yeah, um, Trunks goes to see Gohan, you know, and um, he he knows that he's different, you know, though. Like, he, he doesn't really sense his power, because, you know, Gohan, he hasn't been really training as much ever since the um, Cell thing happened. So he's like, he's basically like, I can't believe this is Gohan. He, he seems so different and stuff like that. He basically got introduced to the family, Videl, Hercule, and um, Pan. And they did like a little bit of babysitting a little bit while Trunks, I mean, while Gohan was finishing his work and whatnot. But they, they hung out a little bit. He had like, um, ate ice cream earlier before he went to their house and whatnot. And um, it was showing, they did like a flashback in the, the future, well, in the future world. And this got me a little emotional, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but um, like, they basically show like, cause like, this is, I don't know when we wanted a little bit back before he actually met Gohan's family and stuff like that. He was basically like flying on his way to meet Gohan or whatnot. So he was like, like he was looking at a town and he was basically like having like a like a relapse or whatnot. So he was seeing the town destroyed and stuff. And then he um they showed like the flashback like the future. And this Gohan, this, he lost his arm. He got a scar on his face. And this is like when the attack first happened with Black, I'm guessing. I don't, I don't know, no, I don't think it was Black. I think it was the androids, actually, because he meant to go and mention the androids. But, um, Gohan basically tricked Trunks. He was like, he said, I'm gonna go, he was basically like, I'm gonna go fight him, you stay here. And Trunks was like, no, I got, I got it stronger. He was like, okay, let's go. And then Gohan basically knocked him out. And, um, when Trunks wakes up, he finds Gohan dead, basically. And, this is the scene that they showed on the Xenoverse 2 trailer. Where they showed like a part of the scene. And this is like when Trunks is like a teen. Teen Trunks, I would say. But yeah, that, that part right there got me a little emotional right there. Trunks, he was mad, you know, crying and stuff. And he went Super Saiyan. I'm guessing this, I guess this, this is when he first went Super Saiyan, I guess. The future Trunks. Teen future Trunks, I'm guessing. Because it's, it's like alternate universes, you know. But, um... Yeah, the episode is basically um, him reuniting with Gohan, spending time with him, and getting to know this Gohan. Like I said, he had, last time he see Gohan, he was Super Saiyan too. And that's when Gohan was at his strongest form, you know, when he was fighting Cell. You know, he, he, he's getting to know him. He can know Gohan older, you know. He's not as strong as he used to be. He got family now. He's focusing on his studies and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, it was a very good episode for me. I enjoyed the episode. Um, also, towards the end, they showed Gohan, Weez, and Lord Beerus. They're heading to the Universe 10. This is where um, the Supreme Kai's are at. And um, Weez um, got a hint on who's black. So um, it's like Goku's probably going to be Goku's going to be fighting the guy who they believe is black, and they're trying to expose him to the, I guess, the head Supreme Kai of Universe 10 to try, like, to prevent his own uprising, I'm guessing. But yeah, like I said, the episode was pretty good. I enjoyed it. I got a little bit emotional. It had a couple of funny moments on the episode as well. But yeah, overall, I enjoyed the episode. Ready for the next episode. We're going to have some fighting on the episode going down. But yeah, I'm TK. Thanks for tuning in for my recap review of this episode 52. Um, I believe it's called Reunion. Master and student, and so that would be chunks and go on. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. You can follow me on Twitter at TK with Dory Scar. You also can subscribe to get a link my videos like this, my weekly 
Dragon Ball Super reviews and um, trade reactions and other stuff I do on this channel. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. Until next time, I'm out. Peace.